Hey guys, well I gotta make a video about this. It's um, This is one of those tools that I forgot I had. When I bought my air compressor, um, it uh, came with an air set of air tools. It was just part of the deal. And so, you know, I, I knew I had the ratchet and I had the regular um, impact wrench that you would use to change tires. But I had this, I forgot that I even had this. It was sitting in a box and I found it I'm in my tool chest. I pack stuff up really quick for the winter and I've never actually used this thing until today and I don't know why I haven't used this thing. It's a call it's a butterfly impact wrench. Um, 3 8 head and uh, right now I just have a, uh, a Phillips head bit on it but I've been using it for 10 millimeters and whatnot and I'll tell you what this thing is sweet. It's you know so quick and so you thought that a, uh, like an electric drill or drill was quick at taking out screws? Holy cow, this is the tool to have. It's even got the pivoting um, hose, hose end here. And so let's just, you know, pick a screw. Sure, let's, this one looks good. And make so sure I got it lined up. Sorry, it's kind of hard to do this with just one hand, but. Out. Let's go to the next. Again, trying to do this all one-handed, so. Super quick, love it. It's way quicker than my drill even, which, you know, I thought that thing was the bee's knees as far as taking apart the car. But I was mistaken. If you have an air impact wrench, this butterfly one is really sweet because it's, you know, you go back up, forward, that quick. Um, again, this is just a Campbell Housefield one, but it doesn't matter what brand. Highly suggest that um, if you want to take apart a derby car quick, this is your tool. It's easy, very versatile, easy to maneuver around. Um, it's able to take apart the whole front really quick with this tool. Um, it just saves a lot of time um, versus using a drill or something else. It's a lot quicker and it's just as, it's actually easier to maneuver because it's not as tall. So, because you know, once you, once this bends, you can get into some pretty tight spaces. So, there you go guys. Just a tool that I would recommend using when taking apart a derby car, especially if you're doing it by yourself. You can knock this out a lot quicker than if you try to do it by hand or even with the drill. So, there you go. Check it out if you haven't used it.